it's 4 a.m. <laughs> so <laughs> we didn't sleep yet. I'm not gonna say the F word because I don't wanna pay $100. So I screwed up my sleep schedule. Able to sleep on this flight. I, I, I might have like 50 to 70K in buy-ins, you know? Mm. Like spending 1500 to be like well rested when you get there. I don't know, like, I don't know how it is to fly business, but like, I hope it's like very really nice seats. So I can like just lie down and sleep, you know? I, I kind of hope that I don't love it. <laughs> it's, gonna, it's gonna make my life so much more expensive if I just absolutely love the experience. We're going to the Bahamas to play PSPC and PCA. The weather in London now is absolute dog. It's like freezing cold and gray and sad. Never. <laughs> don't curse on my vlog. I'll just put in my laugh every time instead of the bleep. I have to lose five kilos in eight weeks. If I lose those five kilos, I'm gonna be like the lowest weight I've been pretty much since I was 14 yeah, yeah, yeah. or something. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Blake Eastman, um, who's doing it? It's a charity bet though. Sure. If I had to pay it to him, mm. kind of the end of the burn. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Have the fight. See you there. You're not coming with or what? Yeah, well, I'll, I won't see you because I want a pep test. Was it worth or no? <laughs> I would say no, honestly. If you're on a weight loss bed and you're not drinking alcohol, mm -hmm. like the seat that became a bed was kind of cramped. So you kind of just lie like this and you can't really move too much. This is true. That's the future. <laughs> oh, there we go. Pretty basic, I would say. Let's see the huge person. Oh, we got scammed. These guys have. Uh, they can sit on their ass. This dude. What is this? Okay, well, I'll turn it off and see what happens or what? Mm. Palm trees. And what else? <laughs> <laughs> Getting out of London and coming here into this temperature and these surroundings, I feel reinvigorated. I flapped uh, small blind, six, seven suited. Although playing deep, I don't mind three betting because you just like never get four bet. I end up calling, big blind squeeze is 2.7k. So it's 500, 500, 2.7, call. Oh. We all have starting stack 30k. Tempting, tempting spot. Yeah, anyways, I call ace, six, five. Yeah. With the ace, five of spades, six of clubs. So I have middle pair, oh, so have flush a, draw. A very good hand. Very good hand. <laughs> big blind bets 2.1 into 8.5. Okay. Recreational fold. All versus raise. Raising doesn't make that much sense because it's a bit more polar. You'd probably. be folding out like like king high bluffs basically. Yeah. Like. yeah, so I call turn four of diamonds. So now I would open under it as well. Wow. Check, check. Okay. River, queen of spades, flush, me. These are the tough decisions. <laughs> That's the main event chain breaks. <laughs> and then I just made like the nuts on every street. Like, <laughs> And then on the river, I have a decision how much I want to bet. That's the tough spot. Come on. <laughs> Block, like we bet 20% or something, and then he just calls ace queen. Or like he just calls. I think so too, yeah. And I think that's quite likely actually that he yeah. just decides to flat with like ace queen. Yeah. So yeah, I'm probably all in myself. He's 70 or whatever, and he folds. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I agree theory wise actually. Everybody but the duck. Ew! You're so good. Three bidding, four bidding. Ah, I had a lot of cool hands. Also my tables. It's very raggish, but nice to play. I, I, I bluffed all in as well, one hand. I, mean, I don't know if it... I, I mean, I don't, I'm not sure if this hand is good actually. Cut off open 900 on 400 big blind. Call 5-4 offsuit, heart diamond. Flop, ace, eight, deuce, rainbow. Uh, spade, heart, diamond. Him, 800, so he bets one third. 800 into 24. Me, 24, he calls. Turn is five of spades, so I turn a pair. Feels like it's such a good card for our range, like a lot of our check racing range is gonna be like the small stuff. But I ended up going with big sizing, which I'm not sure if I like. I was setting up a river down basically, so I bet 5.6k. I like it. Now, five river, just nine of diamonds, uh, all in. For, I put him in for like 18, a little bit, fold. It's easy to put in people when you want the world champion, you know? Yeah, I'm blocking, I'm blocking two pairs. No, I like it a lot, to be honest. And any ace is in a tough spot. So the main event's like a net, and now we... Now, now we, we get paid for the image. <laughs> <You know? laughs> it's like me, the opposite. I can play five for a week, and you know, like, I bet it's yeah, cool. Yeah. Like you it. spent 10 years building a fucking maniac image. <laughs> yeah. You have to play tight, man. Uh, I solved it. Chance folds the best hand. Solution, yes, correct. No. no I play both. Sometimes you have to let go and just yeah. do whatever the heart tells you. 
yeah, which is sure. usually bet bet all in. Sure. You really feel the, that, mm -hmm. I don't know, it's a weird dynamic, but it will work. And that's where the instinct comes from. Yeah, sometimes you don't know why you know, but you know. Yeah. No, no, it's uh, your right side of the brain that's been in situations thousands and thousands of time and mm -hmm. see and something that is a pattern, that is an uncommon pattern. We call it instinct, but the reality is the right side of the brain that, uh, you know, is trained to do this for years and it's yeah. like actually your intuition in that place. Flexing with his uh, big brain words here. <laughs> no, no, it's not big brain, I'm dummy, but... Uh... <laughs> yeah, so we're on the third break in a 10k. I think it's like two more levels, right? And then we're finished for a day. It's pretty short day, it's pretty chill. Anyways, I played like, this messed up hand versus Marther, where I open ace and off and I cut off. Marther calls button off like 20k. Small blind Eric Wara, he calls the small blind of 20k as well. Uh, Michael Rocco, he calls the big blind with 20k as well. King, queen, nine, heart, heart, heart. So I have not flush draw on mono board, check. Turn, king of spades, check, check. Pot is 6.2k. Me? What do we do? Maybe I like to also bet the flop. You go bad, bad, bad. Can't be bad. But Can't be bad. Still multi way, they all play too tight, I think. Yeah, I bet 4.2. Seems like we're like we're betting very polar on the turn, right? Marather calls button. Danger, I think. It's kind of dangerous. Like he should be really tight here. When he calls turn, I think he has like king jack, a flush, king a, a king, or like queen jack off, queen ten off with the heart. Hmm? Not many flushes. River is a blank. He has like 16k to play. Pot is like 14. That's what I'm thinking. Do I want to jam into him? It's like one of the last levels of the day. He has a short stack now. Do you think he's gonna make any tight folds here? No, he's gonna call it off. Yeah. Like, okay, I get to go hang out with my girlfriend and I re-enter tomorrow. The check, honestly. You shouldn't bluff much there. It feels like our hand should always bluff versus someone who can fold. But I don't think it's gonna fold. So I check and he checks back and he also has ace-10 with a 10 of hearts. Which I think is like horrendous call on the turn. But Two more levels and then we're... Yeah, hopefully bagging so we don't have to come back tomorrow. We have a nice have a day off tomorrow, I think. Yeah. Are you scuba dive? Seems scary. Sure. Lost weight, bad? Yeah? It's the best. Wait, so I'm gonna lose weight scuba diving? You go 20 minutes, yeah. you burn 750 calories just by watching each. You, you bag? Yeah. Two nice. starting stacks. I paid two bullets for Two starting for stacks? It. Yeah, I paid 20k for it. Isn't nice. that wonderful? I paid for one starting stack and I bagged one starting stack. 29k. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I played so many cool hands today. I'm just expecting an empty nose pad. <laughs> so many cool hands. Huh? Leaked. I typed very fast. Oh, oh, this guy. So the guy gets oh. picked now? Okay. Yeah. Fair. Yeah. It's your phone, it's gonna pick you, bro. It's your phone. It's gonna pick you. I've lost so many dinner books in a row now, all the way. <laughs> oh, another free dinner by Espen. Man, I love it. I can't believe this. It's your phone, of course it's gonna pick you. <laughs>